Welcome to Canada, my friend, ladies and gentlemen, the President of the United States of America, Joe Biden. U.S. President Joe Biden and Canadian Prime Minister Justin Trudeau on Friday pledged to stand together in friendship and against authoritarian regimes from Russia to Iran to China. Because of our shared prosperity is deeply connected to our shared security. In the past, in the past years have proven that Canada and the United States are not insulated from the challenge that impact the rest of the world. The world needs Canada and the United States working together with our partners around the world to rally strong and effective global action. Biden addressed the Canadian Parliament on his visit to Ottawa and remarked on the neighbors' shared values and culture. Americans and Canadians are two people, two countries, in my view, sharing one heart. He did, however, make one provocative remark about a Canadian hockey team. I have to say, I like your teams except the Leafs. The two leaders affirmed their commitment to support Ukraine as the war-torn country battles against Russia's invasion and vowed to build up North American competitiveness in the face of economic challenges from China. With growing competition, including from an increasingly assertive China, there's no doubt why it matters that we turn to each other now to build up a North American market on everything from semiconductors to solar panel batteries. Ahead of their meeting, the two countries also reached an agreement updating a treaty aimed at stopping asylum seekers traversing the U.S.-Canada border via unofficial crossings.